you've often expressed your um, frustrations in the game like I feel like sometimes I've spoken to you and you've been very close to saying uh, I feel like I want to give up I'm not getting the props that maybe I deserve like um, I'm not getting the love Ooh, you know what I mean like break that down to me man because I've always had that sort of feeling that's coming from Red 3 2 over the, over the past I'd say year or so yeah, man, that, like I don't know man, as an artist, yeah, you get disheartened at times, man, like, a man will phone you and be like, bro, this, this guy just got something, or this guy just got a deal, or it's just happening, rare, rare, but when, like, you don't know what you want, and when you don't know what you expect, yeah, you don't know, you don't know what you're getting now, like, you don't know what you want, so, you're always going to be upset, because you don't know what you want, like, me, I know what I want now, what I want, yeah, I just want to build up my fan base. That's what I want to do. Like, first and foremost, like, I just want people... I don't want people that just say, you know what, I only like Red Tree 2 when he spits on hip-hop. Or I don't want people to say, I only like Red Tree 2 when he spits on grime. I just want people to like Red Tree 2 for Red Tree 2. Like, the same way I walk into HMV and I buy Jay-Z's album, because I like Jay-Z, not because I like rap or hip-hop, and I buy a ghetto CD because I like ghetto, not because I like grime. You know what I'm saying? That's that's like, I just need people that are with me to be with me. And then I don't know where I'm going. Like, but people, you you do get frustrated, like, because I know what I'm writing in it. So it's like, what can't these people hear? They dumb. But then I've I've realised, bro. I'm, as I said earlier on, I know what it's like because I've been there. You get what I'm saying? I've been the person that didn't understand. So I know what it's like, bro. I really do know what it's like. But now it's just about. It's just about me just I just know what it is in it. It's just about me moving forward. Like I've been in the room, like I've sat in the room with someone with my punctuation video, yeah? And like we, when it first came out, like to get it on their channel and I'm like watching it with the person that owns the channel and they're like watching the video. I'm I'm looking at him, you know, I'm just watching him watch the video. And he's like he ain't said nothing. Then when it's got to the end, he's like, should have done the one at the end. That's when I realised this thing's crazy. He didn't understand what the hell I just spoke about. But as soon as he heard something catchy at the end, he was like, yeah, man, go with that. I'm like, come on, bro, what the... That's not really, you know what I'm saying? So I realised what's going on. I've, I, like, I've been in the room with some of the best MCs and I've said stuff. Like, when I'm spitting and that, and it's like, I can tell that a man hasn't understood what I'm saying. And, like, I can see when, what people understand and what they don't, but I get a kick out of that. Like, I just, it's like I feel like I've got one over on someone, like, ah, they don't really understand what I mean. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, I, I always know what to expect. I know that that person doesn't always sell the most, but he has longevity. Like, i.e., Soldier Boy might come out and sell a crazy amount of shit, a crazy amount of singles, maybe even a crazy amount of albums. But common will last 10 years longer than him. You know what I'm saying? So that's 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 what I'm just trying to do. I'm trying to have longevity. I'm trying to build.